Gemini, this is Marisha, you're on my channel Chiloka. I am doing some Lenormand readings for the coming week of July. So there is a little change um, in the way I'm going to do the reading today. And uh, I'm not going to use two different decks, I'm just going to use my other uh, Rosa's Lenormand deck. Uh, previously in my um, previous read, uh, videos, I have used uh, the Enchanted Lenormand deck uh, for extra messages uh, to, uh, you know, um, see what's going on behind the scenes to see what's going on in the head of the other person uh, so it was an elaborate reading and uh, it was time consuming as well and i noticed some of the people um, who came to my video uh, didn't have the patience to watch through the whole thing of it but i do appreciate the people who watched through it and uh, did give me feedback on the same so um to keep it short and um, if it works for the other people as well if i make it short okay short and sweet that's what I'm going to try this time. If you really want me to go back to the elaborate readings, do let me know in the comments and I will consider it from the next week probably. Okay, so uh, Gemini, this is the last reading which I'm doing uh, today. I've done 11 readings before you back to back. So I'm glad we are on the last reading and I can take a sip of water after this reading. So uh, Gemini, what do you need to know? Or what do you need to know in the coming week of July? Or probably this reading might be uh, uh, for the coming weeks of July. What is it? Ooh. Ooh. That's a clover. We have another one. Owls. Okay, which is a bird in the tradition deck. Three more cards, please. So there is already some chatter. Okay, some talks. Uh, because the bird is literally about communication. So something is coming up. Uh, which seems like um, good luck. Okay, something uh, lucky, something which is regards to your heart, you have to make a decision on it. Okay, two more cards, please. Okay. There is definite communication, okay, uh, there's some, uh, some ending as well. Okay, so there is, if you are not in this situation right now, there is going to be lots of talks about this situation. Yeah, let's get two more cards, okay. Gemini. Two more cards. One more. Fox in the uh, fox is a card behind the deck. Can you see? Okay. So we have the crossroads, which is coming through. So you are at a crossroad. You are at the verge of making a decision, okay, in regards to some situation. You are at the junction, okay, uh, deciding which path to take, okay. There is um, lots of talks which is going on in regards to this, okay. You're brainstorming uh, about this with other people as well. I see um, other people involved in the situation as well, okay. Uh, there is some kind of decision which needs to be taken okay as I said even with the crossroad there is this decision which is uh, being taken um, and this has something to do with your family as well okay with people who are close to you uh, yeah with people who are close to you this might be a decision which is regards to work okay so you need to uh, weigh the pros and cons you need to be strategic about what decision what path you will need to take what decision you need to take for the better betterment of other people who are dependent on you okay uh, you are, i see you contemplating this decision whatever the decision is as i said this can uh, this can be work related even with the fox card fox is also a work card for me um, and bear like the bear is the person uh, if you look at this picture the bear is actually uh, getting uh, has a fish in the mouth so this is the bread earner in the family so when I say uh, clover is something uh, which is you know uh, uh, which has fallen into your lap okay so some kind of an opportunity has fallen uh, fallen into your lap okay you grabbed an opportunity out of the water out of the blue and you are biting into it okay you are you know
growing up, um, deciding whether you need to eat it or share it, okay, with your children or not, okay. So you have it in your hold already, okay, and you have to make a decision what you need to do with this fish, okay, whatever this opportunity which has come through, you you are making a decision what to do about it. You are dis discussing it with those um, with these birds. You are discussing this opportunity or whatever has come through. Okay, you are making a decision with others involved. Okay, so you brainstorming literally. Okay, mm, your family will be involved in this. I see it strongly, and. Uh, This is definitely to do with an opportunity. Uh, you need to make a decision. Uh, for this decision, okay, there would be a, why you have to involve your family is because with the garden, you will have to move. Okay, there might be a question about relocation. That is why you have to involve the other people who are dependent on you, other people who are living with you, or probably who, who you know who are close to you okay people who are close to you maybe uh, you have a girlfriend or you have a fiance or something and you get a job offer which you have to move cities or something you need to discuss with her uh, as well okay it is not your uh, sole decision so i see you discussing with the other people who who are in who is also having a say in this matter although it is your job okay it is your career you have to ask their opinion as well okay so if you're already married and you have children you have to involve them as well because there is a little move happening because with the garden there is some kind of a new location happening so you're discussing with this uh, other birds okay in the picture okay um, uh, probably the children or the uh, people who are close to you uh, what to do about this okay which path to take do i take it you know or you know uh, throw the fish back into the water you are making a decision how to go about it and you will come to a decision which will be thought out wisely okay which will uh, be the good for everybody who is involved you will be uh, strategic about it you will be uh, uh, I also want to say with this card, I never uh, said that before, I, I, I will say, although you have this fish in your mouth, okay, you are grabbing onto this opportunity, you know, um, uh, you know, this is good, okay, with this clover, this is good. For courtesy's sake, you're speaking to the other people who are involved, okay, you're going to convince them, okay, uh, although it might seem like you want you are confused and you want to ask the opinion but you have made up your mind okay you are like uh, coming out as a fox or whoever uh, the cross watcher uh, you coming out as this fox okay you have made up your mind to grab uh, you know to bite onto this fish you are net, uh, not letting go of this fish you have no intention of you know uh, spitting the fish out okay because you do realize this is something really good okay this comes once in a lifetime or you know once in a blue moon kind of an opportunity and you were waiting on this opportunity to happen okay and you willing to do uh, you know uh, take the chance okay if you have to make a decision if you have to move away to a new location you are willing to do that okay and this whole foreplay okay about you know discussing it with your family and uh, you know you want to discuss it with your fiance because uh, they also they also have a say all this is like i'm going to be blunt about it uh, all this is like um, you know just for the heck of it you have already made your decision okay you know exactly what you want you are going to take it okay and all this uh, drama of which you are you know creating um to give importance to the other people but i see this manipulation energy you're going to convince them although you might seem like a person who is like oh, what should i do about it it is a good opportunity but uh, you know i i cannot leave you people behind you know it is going to be long distance i'll have to or else you'll have to move with me you know you you will convince them and you will convince them in such a way that they say agree to you that okay you should take it it is a one-time opportunity you're not going to say it out of your mouth you will make them say 
okay that is that is happening behind the scenes okay with just five card decibel that is a story for you guys um so whoever is playing uh, okay uh, they know exactly what they want okay and uh, they are not willing to let go of this offer for anybody okay and it's just you know just the drama just the foreplay before the final climax okay that would be it uh gemini wonderful reading for you guys thank you so much until next time this is marishi you're my channel Shiloh, bye